my skills academy, the children are working to develop uh, and create their own apps. Um, so we use the, the app shed software, uh, pupils plan and then they, they create a working model of, of their own apps. Well, in Skills Academy we made an app and it's for a company called Visage and we've been designing it and there's biz you can choose from many different types of things. You can choose business cards, leaflets, banners or posters. As part of the Skills Academy we have designed an app what for the company not posh click on the dresses icon it will bring you to a slot of all of them and basically you pick the one you want by just clicking on it and then there you have the sizes available and the colors which are available and if they're in stock What I've learned are to um, how to build an app, what to use, how to save an image. The skills that we have learned by designing the app is planning of how to make the app and uh, uploading pictures and saving them to get them on to the app. As I said, part of the Skills Academy, we're now designing apps um, as working models. What's great is then some of the pupils um, have taken that back into the classroom, that knowledge. Um, in one particular case, the Primary 5 um, class were working on a, a Dragon's Den programme and one of the groups of children who'd done Skills Academy with me decided that their product wouldn't be a, a traditional made solid object but an app. Uh, offering a service, so they built a work model for that and were able to showcase it um, to the, the Dragon's Den panel and were successful, I believe that they won. We're always looking for new opportunities to uh, engage the pupils and, and add that depth and breadth to their learning. Um, and one of the ones recently was we uh, um, had an opportunity to bring the Google Expeditions team into the school. Um, so we took uh, two of our classes on a trip under sea, uh, into space, uh, into the moon and back, literally without having leaving the seats. Um, what's really good after that is we then use that as a another motivator uh, or an inspiration towards the, the Skills Academy where people then want to develop their own software for, for the Google Cardboard and the Google Expeditions. Um, so it's always giving them, showing them those opportunities and seeing where they want to take it next. I took my Skills Academy, we, we were speaking about the possible career paths for, for pupils um, and you know, it was a great variety from making YouTube videos to working in graphical design that pupils identified. We then used that list to, to identify the skills that they needed to create, to, to get the opportunities in those jobs, those careers. Um, that then formed the basis of our whole skills pathway for, for ICT learning at, at the school. So from pupils identifying career paths using ICT and, and digital learning, they then came up with a, a set of skills that they felt they needed to get those jobs. And we then used those skills to inform the, the whole curricular pathway for, for ICT in the school. it was really good to know how it actually you can actually apply it in the world of work so it was a really good opportunity to see to develop my career uh, choices because I didn't really know what I was going to be before uh, the skills academy came along and then it said okay um, this is giving you the skills to do several things in the future when you're just young as us so it's just giving us tons of opportunities From an employer's perspective, technology is so important. Um, if I look back at when I entered the printing industry, which was 30 years ago, um, technology wasn't really utilised, computers weren't to the fore, um, but it changes on a daily basis and you've got to think of the end result and utilise technology to get you there quicker and with more quality.
and get the job done better. Through our links with the, the Apps for Good website, um, one of our partners um, have a, a Skype call uh, once a session with the Skills Academy uh, and our partner Richard and he just explains to them about his career path in the IT industry and points them towards some ways that they can start, whether it's as an apprentice or as a graduate and it gives them a wee idea about some of the, the earning potential and some of the exotic places they can, they can choose to work if they wish. So that's always good to engage the children when they to speak to someone who's uh, worked in that field. As a parent of a couple of boys at Busby, I just have found Skills Academy invaluable. Um, they've learnt so much how to communicate with other children and communicate to project their ideas to a wider audience. Um, the, the ability to work together, the cooperation you have to feel between your, your colleagues, your um, fellow pupils, and um, all these things in addition to the actual physical skills that they've learnt with, with maybe woodwork or designing an app or, or certain cookery skills or any of the things that they're working on and um, putting all those things together just brings them out as a very rounded person.